Felix Verdeer, one of the biggest, most talented fighters out of Puerto Rico, former Olympian, just turned pro already. How many fights do you have in one year? How many fights do you have in one year? Well, I'm going to have the ninth fight. I just had my ninth, ninth fight. That's crazy. Who fights nine times in one year? And they're all wins. And how does he like that fighting so much? I don't like to fight so much. I like it now because I'm staying focused in the gym and acquiring experience quickly. I like it because it keeps me focused, keeps me in the gym, and keeps me uh, working hard on the gym here now. We have a lot of legends coming out of Puerto Rico, from Trinidad to Miguel Cotto, and you're going to be there too. How do you like that, where you're almost now the biggest name out of Puerto Rico? Well, it's like an honor for me that it can be a good one. El nombre más nombrado ahora mismo de los prospectos, pues, pues este, le doy la gloria a Dios primero que nada y de verdad que me siento bien contento, ¿verdad? Y agradecido de Dios. I'm very happy. First of all, I want to thank God and, and for, for me to be considered among the best prospects in Puerto Rico. It's just a great thing and you know, I just keep working hard for it. If Cotto fights Canelo, what do you think of that fight? Pues es una pelea difícil, son dos, dos tros chocando y la verdad que está, está difícil esa decisión. Sería una buena pelea de México y Puerto Rico. I would, it's, it's a tough fight, I mean, it's a very, very hard fight. I mean, there are two trucks crashing into each other, so I mean, it would be a great fight, Puerto Rico versus Mexico, but I really don't know. And Malasca, how did you like this whole experience in China, the arena yesterday, the fight reels, Pacquiao, how was all this? I'm very happy. I mean, the, the place was was great. Uh, the people of China have been, have been awesome. I mean, they were taking pictures with me, and, and they're always laughing and smiling all the time. Any message to all your fans right now from here to Puerto Rico? Pues que sigan apoyándome en mi desarrollo y y vamos para adelante que esto está comenzando. Just just to keep keep watching me. I mean, this is just starting and still developing, but. This is just the beginning. Thank you very much, Mitchell Classes. There you have it. Stay tuned. Look out for big things coming for this future champion. FaceNewsReporting.com and Melissa Quack reporting.